We wanted to share some sad news with you guys. We had our little um, hamster pass this week, Chi Chi. Um, she came here to Mexico with us a year ago and she had a really good life here in Vallarta, but this past Monday she left and it's been really hard because she's had a lot of adventures here with us. Um, she's She lived a really good life here in Mexico, um, but unfortunately she left us. And she traveled a very long way from Chicago to Puerto Vallarta because when we were moving to Puerto Vallarta, uh, we didn't know that hamsters are not allowed to fly on the plane because they could go into holes underneath, cut wires. So we could only take our two doggies with us on the plane. But Chi Chi had to go into one of our trucks and with one of our drivers, she drove to the um, Mexican border and a moving company from Mexico picked her up and they took her all the way here. So the journey was uh, four days from Chicago to oh, Puerto this Vallarta. Is my favorite toy. Hamsters live a very short life. I wasn't expecting for her to only live two years. I thought that with all the tacos and tamales that I was giving her, she would live a little longer. Hamster eats tortilla. Chi Chi does. <laughs> it eats you like a chicken. You know, all jokes aside, I know that she had a very pleasant life here. Um, she got to experience a lot of things that re like a regular hamster would not experience. Um, we always took her out of her cage. We always spent time with her. Um, she was always well fed and cleaned and groomed. Um, but it was a very um, tough time for us on Monday, especially that we had a lot of wonderful memories here with her. Um, a big part of letting go, we wanted to put her into nature. We wanted her to be surrounded by the birds and the mountains. So where do we take Chi Chi? To the jungle? Where do we take her? Jungle. And we're going all the way up the mountains to say the final goodbye. Rest in peace up in the mountains in Puerto Vallarta. Okay, we found the perfect place for Chi Chi right here in the mountains. Right where you can see the beautiful, beautiful view. view. Alright, let's go, guys. Yeah, so we took Chi Chi to the jungle, and what did you guys do? What did we put? We put her, we had to go get her a nice box. And what did what did we do with Chi Chi? What, what, what did you guys put in, into Chi Chi's box? We put flowers. flowers, and what else did we put in there? Leaves. Leaves. Yes, and then we closed it together, right? We closed the box. We said goodbye to Tichi. We gave her, we pet her. We said our goodbyes. We said how much we love her. And where is Chichi now? In the jungle. In the jungle, yes. We took Chichi up to the Sierra Madres, um, la, 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 close to our close to our home here and both of our boys <laughs> helped their father to the, to the mountains yeah helped um chris dig a little hole for her and we laid her to rest and uh when philip philip is four years old benji's three years old so philip was really sad that morning when we told him that chi chi went to sleep and she will not be around anymore so he took it a little hard. Um, Benji doesn't really realize what's no. going on. He's asking like you know, childish questions. If dinosaurs are gonna come and take her, if she's gonna come back. So he doesn't really um, know the concept, but I think it's uh, important for them that they get familiarized with the concept of uh, someone or family passing so that when they are older and something like that happens, they are emotionally prepared for this. So our little celebration was yeah, not really mourning, it was celebration of Chichi's life, her journey from Chicago to Mexico, being part of our family, trying all the wonderful food, 
and she had really good life and we were sad but also happy that she will be now part of the nature here in our new home in Puerto Vallarta. Yeah, and now the kids always ask, can we go visit Chi Chi? And we put flowers there on top of her little oh. grave. Um, and I know and I feel mm. that this was the best. And when I saw her on Monday yes. or even the night before and she was suffering, I, I lost it. So um, I'm happy that we did a little celebration for Chi Chi and yeah, we want to pay our tribute here for her uh, in Mexico. Yes. Yes. Do you miss Chi-Chi? Yes. Um, was she funny? Yes. Was she a good girl? Was she a model? Good. Was she a model? Did she like to take pictures? Yeah. Yeah. She had a wonderful personality. She was so affectionate. She loved to cuddle. She was part of our family, you know, $14 hamster that you get at Petco or PetSmart or wherever we got her, she was more than $14 to us. So, you know, such a little little hamster, but such a big heart, so. Yeah, such a big heart. And we gave her a lot of love and everything we could to make her life the best. <laughs> yeah, so say, we love you, Chi Chi. We love, we love you, Chi Chi. And we miss you. We miss, I miss you so much. So much. Bye, baby. <laughs> Bye, baby, Chi Chi. Love you. Love you, Chi.